Hello, Chris from My Stamp Lady, and I'm really excited to share with you this card I made today. It's fairly simple. It is elegant looking with just the black and the off-white. So, and I got to use my new magnetic platform, which I just love with the frame light here. So let's get started. So I started with a half a sheet of eight and a half by 11 berry vanilla cardstock, and that is just folded in half to make my card base. I have a piece of one and three quarter inch by five and a half inch pattern paper and I'm just going to place that along the edge here. You can see this card is fairly quick. A piece a uh, length of the very vanilla seam binding to coordinate with the colors I have here. So I'm just going to, I want to kind of keep with the elegant theme so I'm going to do a bow and notch my ends. And then I will just notch this end and fold it in half and notch the other end. And look at that, there's my card base ready to go. So then what I did is I took this image from the Chalk Talk set. I embossed it in white, but because I'm using, I wanted it embossed, I like the look of that on the black, but because I'm using it on with the very vanilla cardstock, I took some of the soft suede ink and a sponge dauber and just gave it a little bit of an aged look went over. Now because the embossing powder will resist and rub off this ink, I have found if I just dab it on and then after I dab it on, I heat it a little bit, it will melt in. Oh, there we go. I'm really getting now it now on there. Heat it just a bit. and it will hold that color a little bit. Okay, so now I get to pull in my Big Shot with my magnetic plate. Love this magnetic plate that's new from Stampin' Up. It has magnets within this area of the platform. They're little round disc magnets, and those will hold the framelit on. You do want to have a fairly straight or flat acrylic pad, and if yours is not, you can roll it through several times flipping it until it becomes fairly straight. And then I put my cardstock on there, and what's great about the magnets is that it grabs and it will hold the framelit in place as it goes through the big shot. This has been just wonderful. I know that they've been very popular and I can't recommend them highly enough. And you roll that through and then I can just pop that out of the framelit. Okay, let's pull this back in. I have stamped this in black, the For You from the Chalk Talk set. And with the one and three, quarter, three eighths inch, circle punch. I'll punch that out. Take a little dimensional. Put that so I have a little pop up there. Put that in there. And then just take some dimensionals to pop this off the front of my card base. and place that right next to my designer paper. And you have a very simple and quick, elegant card. I can move this up a little bit if I want. Put that bow up a little higher. If you have any questions about what I did today, please contact me at chris at mystamplady.com and thanks for watching.